Okay, so we're gonna go over a right high oblique sit pull down. So it's gonna look a little bit like this. So you're gonna need something to put the, a portion of your right hip on so you can get your right knee to the floor. Okay, so let's go through this. So you're gonna need a band or a pulley to be able to help you out of this position. From there, what you're gonna do is your left foot is gonna be in front of your right foot. And so you're gonna reach with this knee, which is parallel to the cable, you're gonna reach it forward so that your knee comes down to the ground. And then you're gonna let the band pull you forward more. So again, your knee is firmly on the ground, okay? From there, as I do that, I naturally am going to need to put a hand right here so it's in line with the cable and my knee. So I'm in one line right there. And I'm gonna stay heavy towards the pinky side of my hand so that my shoulder doesn't end up like this. So I'm reaching with the knee, reaching with the arm, getting the knee down, and I'm gonna feel like I have to push through this right hand. It just, it will happen naturally as I reach forward with these two things. So as I'm there, I'm gonna take a breath of air in. As I exhale, pull this down to my hip. As you get more flexible and, it's a, and you become more, uh, stronger, and then what you can do is actually start to have it come across your body and you're gonna pull it down here. That's when you can start to pull more weight, okay? Let me know what you got for questions.